Boop. So this is the next video. I've titled it More Basic Mechanics. <laughs> The, the first video was the introduction plus basic mechanics. This is more basic mechanics. Uh, so what is KOF? What is the general goal of the game? Etc. 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 What makes it different from what, what, what makes it different from, from Street Fighter, uh, Skullgirls, Marvel Three? What makes it its own game? Tekken, you know. Um, and for that, I'm gonna go into versus mode. Uh, this is a team game. You'll never, ever, 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 ever see single versus. You'll always see team versus. And to begin this video, I just wanted to play a game uh, and show you the general structure of the game. Uh, so you select three characters in the colors first. So pick three characters that you think look cool. Uh, I think Takuma looks cool. I'll be using a lot of Takuma today. Uh, Shen's pretty cool. Look at that smile on him. Uh, then you can play the drunk dude, Chin, with a color. Uh, you, you begin with ten colors and you can customize your own colors. Uh, you'll, you'll, you'll get more colors the more you play characters, but... And then I'll give him random characters. Uh, so one keg is going to come in at a time, and whoever loses three characters loses, basically. It's a rush to kill people. This is the computer player, by the way. So it's really easy to kill him. Oh my god. <laughs> Super jump. Oh, he got me. So we can HD him. Oh, he got me. I showed you some HD combos there, but that's the the whole point of that was to be like, hey, it's three characters. Once you kill the first one, the next one comes in, etc. So there's a maximum of five rounds, and and a minute and a, a minimum of three rounds. <coughs> um, so let me explain what exactly what's going on in the game. 
and I'm gonna be using Takuma for this because he's gonna um, explain some stuff. <coughs> no, these are not the same person, I swear. They just look exactly the same. So there's a whole bunch of bars on screen. There's a big green one with a blue one, and then there's like a flashing green one with a yellow one. What do these guys all mean? Let's do this. Alright, so... When the game first begins, it's, it's gonna look like this. Nothing in the bottom, and everything in the top is full. Uh, so, the big green thing is the health bar. When you hit people, they lose health. Obviously, this is training mode, so it's gonna refill, but... Whenever that green bar hits zero, that character is dead. <laughs> they can't fight anymore, and then that's the end of the round, and the next character comes in. Uh, the, every single character in this game has 1,000 hit points. Uh, and you'll also notice that the health bar is divided equally into 10 sections. So each little section, if you see it up there, it's each little, di like, of those 10 little divisions, I guess, is 100 health. Uh, so for, for example, like, uh, T Takuma has a move that does exactly 100 damage, so you can kind of tell when it'll kill and when it won't kill, etc. Um... It's just helpful in that way. Um, you win rounds that way. Okay, and, and then uh, in between the two is, is the timer. Right now it says in infinity symbol, uh, but for most games it's going to start at 60 by default, and then it's going to go down one every one and a half seconds. So technically every round is not 60, it's not 60 seconds, it's 90 real time seconds. But the timer says 60. Yeah, meh. <laughs> Whatever. It's not as bad as Marvel. Uh, uh, so I, I have some notes here uh, on the timer. The remaining time on the timer indicates how much health you will get back after winning a round. The more time remaining, the more health you get back. So when you kill the opponent's character, you're, the next round, the character that you're using is going to come in with more health than what you left off with. It's kind of like a bonus for like winning the round. Uh, the quicker you kill them, the more health they get back, basically. Um, if the timer runs out, then the one with the, one with, uh, the most remaining health wins. Um, basic stuff. However, because there's no timer left, you don't get any health back next round. Um, because of the offensive nature of this game, you don't ever see timeouts, really. Not in this game. M maybe sometimes in K with 14, maybe. But not very often. Um, so the thing under the health gauge, the blue thing, it says guard gauge. That's the guard gauge. Um, it goes down when blocking things. So notice he's gonna block stuff for me. It goes down, and then it, and then when you're not when you're not blocking, it slowly rises. And it's full again. So, what does this gauge do? Well, I showed it off earlier in the previous video. You can guard crush people when they block too much, and you'll get a free combo for that. So, like, so he's at the all guard. He, he's gonna block whatever he can. I'm just gonna keep hitting him. When you guard crush someone, you get a free combo for them uh, almost every single time. There's exceptions, but not many. The gist of this meter is don't block too much, which I I I, I mentioned that in in the in the previous video. Just don't don't block everything, uh, especially certain attacks like this. this. 
Watch his guard gauge. Boom, guard crash. <laughs> That's character specific, but hey. Um, uh, one last thing ab ab um, about the guard gauge, it's not every character has the same length guard gauge. Like, on the screen, it'll, it'll be the same like number of pixels wide, but some characters, such as Daimon, uh, it takes more hits to, to break their guard. That's just a, a, a balance decision they've made in this game. Next is the energy meter, which is the yellow thing. It starts off zero. How do you build energy? Well, you make contact with the opponent. That's how you do it. Let me turn this back on. So notice the yellow bar is slowly filling up. Also notice that, that the one blocking builds a lot more meter than the one attacking. That's very important for later on. And when it fills, it empties again, but, not, but, but now he has like a one next to his meter. So, so he has one stock of energy to use. And this will continue up, up to five times max and, until you have five meters. Uh, sometimes it's called stocks. You have five stocks, or sticks of butter is what some people call it. I don't ever, I don't ever call it that. So don't, 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 don't call it that. Uh, things this is used for. This is used for um, generally either making your attacks more powerful, or giving them new properties, or making them faster, for example, or making them deal more damage. Um, so one way to use it is enhance special moves, that's, that's the blue thing, when I flash blue, that's, that's, that's an enhanced special move. Um, next is supers. Uh, you can enhance supers. As regular Rambu. Wait, you can't answer that one. No, so There's that one. Super Firewall. And then Super Super Firewall. Uh, which costs 2 meters. Uh, EX moves cost 1 meter. Supers cost 1 meter. Uh, EX Supers cost 2 meters. You can also use Guard Cancels. That wasn't good. They look like that. Uh, if I put my meters on normal. Notice I burned a bar. To cancel my guard animation. Um, I'll get into more specific stuff about that later on. Next video probably. Uh, when I go over the advanced uh, system mechanics. Uh, the one above the energy meter. The one that's like green and flashing is the overdrive meter, or the, actually, I, I believe it's the overdrive gauge. Um, it builds up almost the same way as energy, which brings up another concept I want to talk about. Which is... Uh, when you use special moves, you build energy. Notice my energy is going up. But my drive meter is not. In addition, when you give the drive meter, it builds very slowly. Like. Now I have one drive, and by drive I mean half of this meter is a drive. It it has two two equal uh, two uh, equally spaced portions, um, and the and those are called drive or stocks of drive. Um, so this meter is used for a couple a lot of different things actually and it's not used in the same way as energy meter energy meter is more of just augments to your attacks 
Drive meter is ways to string your attacks together in ways you couldn't otherwise. Um, an example is with drive cancels, which I'm going to put these meters on uh, on full now, on in infinity. So, uh, normally you can't take one special move and then cancel into a second special move. However, there's a canceling system which I'll get into when I go over combos and other combo things together. Um, however, with drive cancel, notice it, it took one of my drives and said drive cancel. So I can take these two moves and combo them together when I normally shouldn't be able to. Um, the thing about drive cancel is you can't do them on block. Um, if the opponent blocks or this misses completely, you're not going to be able to drive cancel. It has to be on hit. Um, um, the next thing that you can do with this meter is the super cancel, which is exactly the same. It's going to be exactly the same, except into a super. And it says super cancel instead of drive cancel. And these might seem exactly the same, except one burns a meter and does a super. Except for one major difference. Uh, I can't show it here. But you can actually do these on block. I don't know how to show this one. How do I show this one? How do I, how do, I do this? Help me. Uh, Takuma. Okay, I don't know how to do it with Takuma, but I can do it with him. So here is a drive cancel that you'll see a lot. Let's see if I can do it. Maybe I can't do it. Okay, there's not a drive cancel. Let's, let's do this one. Uh, but super cancel, you, you can do it on block, so... Uh, I can't make him block. God dang it. What's a, what's a, what's a super cancel I can use on block, guys? Someone help me. Uh, examples. Uh, oh, I, I know one. Duh. Right there. He, he blocked that one. I can still super cancel it. So that's one use of super cancels. Uh, the next thing that you can use both of these meters for, both energy and overdrive, is the Neomax. Which, for your character, it's going to be the very last move. The Neo Max super special move. Uh, Biruto Apar from Fortikuma. Very flashy move. Very unsafe on block. But very useful. But, also, I, I, but what it costs is your entire overdrive meter and two stocks, or sorry, three stocks of energy. Okay, I'll put this back on normal. Whoops. It takes three energy in your entire overdrive meter. So, it better be worth it and... Yeah. If you look at the damage on this... It does about 450 damage for... for again, it's going to be dependent on your character. Uh, but... It's... You can... For three bars, you can do... Like, I can do that damage for a bar, and no drive. It's not very useful to just throw out. It's not like an ultra, where it's gonna, like, once every round, you'll get this, and it'll be like, oh, I got a bunch of damage, because I guessed right. Um, it's more of a combo tool, which I'll get into how to use it in combos more efficiently. Right now, actually, almost right now. Because there's one more thing that you can do with the, with the drive meter, which is HD mode, and this is the thing, oh god. This is a hyperdrive mode, and you'll notice that I, I, I've used it, and then my meter started going down. I'm, I'm like glowing or whatever. It empties, and now it's gone. Uh, that's hyperdrive mode, or HD mode. I'm going to call it HD mode from now on. And what this does is it essentially gives you infinite drive cancels for that period of time. 
and you're gonna get infinites during this. You're, you're, you're gonna be able, to, you're, you're gonna find loops to do that do a lot of damage when when re repeated a certain number of times, and that's gonna be a combo. Um, so one example. I missed that one. That, that, that's an example of an HD combo where I utilize the infinite drive canceling system to loop moves together and keep the opponent launched in the air and just combo them continuously. Um, so you'll notice that it didn't say you drive cancel during that. This is HD cancel. <laughs> Let me get this out of the way. This is eight, uh. The HD cancel instead of the, the normal you drive cancel. It's, it's 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 a different it's a different type of cancel uh, for a couple reasons. But the main reason that you want to make note of is you can't you can actually uh, let's see you can you you can use these on block. So there's no longer a super cancel, there's just just HD cancels during HD mode. And um, you can use this for various reasons. You saw one very good one there because it, it keeps them blocking so they, they kind of are forced to block that EX. Uh, 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 cocaine, which shows, which I uh, showed as uh, a lot of guard meter, but that that that's the important that's the important uh, d uh, difference in HD mode is that now you can actually do these drive cancels on block. Um, one more thing about HD mode before I uh, actually that's the end of my notes right there. So this is the end of this video, but one last thing to know. Before that, notice in HD mode, your Neo Max only costs two bars. Right now, I can't do Neo Max. I can't do it. However, if I go into HD mode, I can. While you're in HD mode, your Neo Max only costs two bars instead of the normal three. However, it still takes the remainder of your drive meter. Notice that the drive meter goes down, and when I Neo Max, oops, it, go, it, it all goes away. However, It doesn't matter how much you have left. You can always Neo Max as long as the HD mode is still going. Which means you can do combo like this. Oops. They did 800 damage, and remember, one character's life is 1,000 hit points. So I just spent two bars in HD to deal 80% damage to someone. That's a lot of damage. Uh, but yeah, so that's how you use uh, Neo Max moves in the middle of, well, I guess at the end of combos usually, to give yourself more damage uh, in an efficient manner. So, I guess the thing to take away from that is 
Neo Max in HD mode. One more thing to know is while you're in HD, you have this thing called a max cancel, where you can cancel one of your super moves into your Neo Max, and that's going to be uh, shown. Oh no, it's not. I lied. It, it doesn't tell you this game. But at least one of your super moves, while in HD mode, is going to be able to be cancelled into your Neo Max. So again, this is useful in combos. So you can do lots of damage for three bars. That, 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 that took three because they took one to use the super, and then two to use the the, the, the Neomax. Re, re, uh, remember that Neomax is only cost two while, while in HD. So a Neomax cancel is going to cost whatever bar you spent earlier, plus the two, plus the remainder of your drive meter. So, you can even... Don't. Okay. Some characters you you can uh, cancel their level two super into a Neo Max, but Takuma can't. Uh, so that's gonna wrap up this video um, on the the remaining basic mechanics. This is all you. This is literally all you need to know. These two videos are all you need to know to begin playing the game, start messing around with things. Um, I need to go over the system more in depth. Like, the, the, the only thing that I kind of, like, briefly mentioned that I probably should have taken more time on is throws. Uh, you, you can't block throws. You just have to guard. You can't block them. All guard. You can't block them. Some figures, some figures have command throws. Um... I think that's it. That's all, that's all I have in my notes, and I'm pretty sure I've covered everything that you need to know to begin playing the game. Um, from now on, these videos are going to be assuming that you've watched these two, or at least understand what I've talked about in these first two videos. So I'm going to start taking notes. Start taking notes. Um, thanks for watching, if you have been. I... I really should make up my own outro. That 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 that's singing man in his outro. Um, whatever. Just get out of here. That's my outro. Get out of here. Here, look at this. That's my outro. Get out of here. <laughs>